Now the GSVL MK3 will carry Chandrayaan-2 to its designated orbit. This three-stage launch vehicle is India's most powerful launcher till date and is capable of launching four-ton class of satellites into space. That's 4,000 kgs worth of payload. It has twice the capacity as compared to the GSLC MK2. The GSVL MK3 stands for Geosynchronous Satellite Launch Vehicle Mark III also called the Bahubali thanks to its launch capabilities and is India's heaviest launch vehicle till date. And if you were to look at it, it's as high as a 15-storey building with a height of 43.43 metres. This launcher weighs a whopping 640 tonnes. That's 6,40,000 kilograms. That's the weight of 405 SUVs. Operating in three stages, the GSLV MK3 has three components. The first component is the S200 solid rocket booster, which can be seen on either side of the launcher. This is the first stage of liftoff, which simply means that this stage carries solid propellants and its ignition is what makes the rocket launch. The second component is called the L110 liquid core booster. These are the two clustered Vikas liquid engines carrying the liquid propellants which ignite in the second stage approximately 120 seconds after a liftoff. The last component known as the C-25 cryogenous upper stage marked a major achievement for India in the use of cryogenic technology. It's our most powerful upper stage yet using liquid oxygen and hydrogen as propellants. It's the most complex stage of the liftoff because it has unique design challenges scientists have to get it just right considering the hydrogen is stored at minus 253 degrees Celsius and oxygen at minus 195 degrees Celsius in two separate tanks. For more such videos, subscribe to the NewsX YouTube channel, hit the bell icon.